Now, I've been telling you for a year that they're coming for us, that there is a reverse crusade in progress, a Christian genocide, hundreds of thousands of innocents killed in the Middle East. And seven months ago, I said that we need to bomb ISIS as it began its steamroll through Iraq. Bomb them, bomb them, and bomb them again, for which I was roundly criticized. Our country's response to this threat? The FBI destroys tens of thousands of documents deemed offensive to Islam. The CIA removes the word Islamic before terrorist in those Benghazi talking points. The Fort Hood massacre, the Oklahoma beheading, both workplace violence. Are we morons? Of course, none of this should be a surprise, given that our president invited the Muslim Brotherhood to fill the first two rows of his apology for being an American speech in Cairo in 2009. And as we cower to these Islamic fanatics, our president and former Secretary of State Clinton say they will prosecute the man who made the video, free speech be damned. They call murders accompanied by Allah Akbar workplace violence. This surrender is nothing more than a coward's response to the fear of this fanatical terrorism. And this political correctness will be the death of us.